Hi, I'm Laura, your wine girl, and I'm here today to talk to you about Scout and Cellars Viente. And this is the 2018, I um, mean, uh, Cabernet Sauvignon, which, if you know me, that's my wheelhouse. I'm a cab girl or some kind of really deep red blend, so these are my favorites. And this was uh, another one added to my favorites. I like this one because it kind of goes with everything, and um, I am really, uh, you know, wines from Chile. They are just so popular. And I have to say, this one is also vegan, which, if you didn't know, a lot of wines are not vegan, and you never think of a wine not being vegan. Doesn't make much sense, but it is true. So if you're looking for one, this is it. It's a 2018. It's very earthy, which I like to taste the earth in my wines. I do, which is why I'm a red girl. And it's very bold, full body, which is great. So it has hints of cherry and um, peach and a little bit of pepper, red meat, as well as uh, roasted vegetables. And this is from the, I know I'm going to probably mess it up, Colchagua Valley. I could be saying that wrong, which I probably am. I'm sure I am. But that's where it's from. And just a little bit more about this. I need to read it because I can't remember everything. Uh, earthier notes of dry tobacco, leaf, black peppercorn, and leather on layered complex frame with smoky tannins and a lingering finish. That's my kind of wine. And it's also my kind of fragrance, which is really interesting, but I never thought about the combination between wines and fragrance but those are all the things I like in a in a in a fragrance as well um perfume fragrance not wine fragrance and so you can definitely eat this with rich with rich meats it's not going to un keep your meal unbalanced it's going to really balance it out and it's 13.7 percent alcohol and 2.1 grams per liter of sugar and as you know all scout and cellar wines do not have added sugar so if this is you're looking for something new, I would say this. They are aged for 20 days in steel barrels um, and then aged with native yeast and then aged in combination of stainless steel tanks and neutral French oak staves for four months before bottling. And what else can I sell you? 2019. Love it. And... Oh, okay. So, many South American vineyards are nestled among some of the tallest and most beautiful mountain ranges in the world with elevations as high as 20, vent day, 1,000 feet. That's where it comes from. All right. The air is thin and dry, making it inhospitable for many pests that attack grapevines, therefore eliminating the need for pesticides. And you know as well that Scout and Cellar, none of their wines have any pesticides in them, where your average bottle of wine has over 300 pesticides, which is why it usually gives you a headache or like a lot of sulfites, where their wines also have little to no sulfites. So if you are vegan, if you are really sensitive to pesticides and sulfites and chemicals, Scout and Cellar is the wine for you. Just go to scoutandcellar.com, bask slash your wine girl. And that's where you can get some wines and deliver it right to your door. Woohoo! We all love that. All right, guys. Scout and Cellar. Check it out.